In four states, voters approved measures supporting marriage equality and LGBT rights. In Minnesota, an anti-gay marriage amendment was defeated by about 53 percent of the vote. Washington and Maryland residents approved measures upholding same-sex marriage laws. And Maine made history by approving marriage equality through a popular vote. From WERU in East Orland, Maine, Amy Brown reports. Lawmakers in Maine passed a same-sex marriage proposal in 2009, but it was repealed by referendum before going into effect. Equality advocates then spent the next three years trying to educate voters about the issue. David Farmer of Mainers United for Marriage says it's a historic win for the state and shows that persistence pays off. Through a lot of one-on-one conversations, a lot of hard work, and people willing to, to open their their hearts and their minds and and reconsider the issue, uh, today we have a much different result. I think what this demonstrates is that people can change their minds and and the arc of public opinion on the issue of allowing same-sex couples to marry is moving toward that. Maine voters approved same-sex marriage by about 53 percent of the vote, roughly the same number that voted to repeal same-sex marriage legislation three years ago. As Norm Bamford and his partner Brad Nadeau watched the election returns at a party in tiny Millbridge, Maine, they reflected on what the right to marry will mean to their family. It's amazing, and we're all just so excited. What it means for, for me in the relationship, and this is I mean, Brad and I, we've been on this right from the the start, and we've done parades, we've done call banks, we've really been pushing this. And what this means for me personally, and I'm going to try not to cry, but for me personally, it means that Brad will have all the rights of a step-parent that he deserves to have, because I have kids that we're bringing into the relationship. And... For him to be able to have the right to, for medical treatment for my children and, you know, and just be a stepdad in the real sense of the word is really what means the most to me. Nadeau had a medical scare earlier this year and realized that he was lucky that the ER that he went to was one that respected his partner's status. But some hospitals, I mean, I found out don't. And, and they wouldn't even let you pass the door, so... And... and uh, and then also, of course, with the health insurance. And so he was able to, to come into the room and with me and be there because and, was, it was really scary. Proponents of same-sex marriage raised an estimated $5 million for the campaign, according to maplight.org. The National Organization for Marriage was the leading funder behind the No campaign, contributing more than $1 million. A spokesperson for the group issued a statement Wednesday morning saying that they are extremely disappointed. Same-sex couples will be able to apply for marriage licenses in Maine within 60 days. Amy Brown, Free Speech Radio News, East Orland, Maine.